Now, I'm not a specialist when it comes to depression, giving prescriptions for depression, or sitting down and having conversation, trying to figure out what's wrong with you. Something that I do well and something that I feel we've done amazingly well at Fit Club is help people to get happy. So I don't focus on your depression. I can help you focus on getting happy. And the solution to that is working out. So here's how we're going to help you get happy. And again, I'm not focusing on any depression. I'm just focusing on how can I help you to get happy. Well, we all know that when we're rested, when we get a good sleep, we wake up feeling relaxed. We wake up feeling refreshed and recharged and ready to take on anything that anybody might throw at us throughout the entire day. Now, when you work out, it actually regulates your sleep because when the sun is up, your body is naturally conditioned to be alive, awake, and well. When the sun is down, your body is conditioned to start to shut you down, release hormones that eventually make you sleep. Now, a lot of us aren't regulating the sleep cycle because our body doesn't differentiate between sleep and being awake because of the fact that we create no activity throughout our entire day. So even if you are functioning, okay, so let's go through a standard person's day. They get up, I don't know, they get up around seven in the morning, okay? They go, they make their coffee, they have their Danish or whatever toast for breakfast. Then they go wake their kids up, they get their stuff ready, they get them off to school. They then either drive to work or they go to their home office, they sit down and they're there and they're planted for an entire eight hours. And I know this because I've been doing this for a long time. And most of the people that are just starting that work desk jobs, They'll get to the gym around five or six in the evening and I check how many steps they got for the day and they're at like 1,500, 1,500 steps. And you're like, oh my God, I can't believe I get so little steps. Trust me, that's the average of what I see people walking into the gym with, 1,500 steps. So that's literally walking from here to your car, from your car to your office, from the office to the washroom a couple times, maybe the lunchroom, back to your desk, and then walking to your car and walking to your car to your house to just be make small little shuffle movements. But when you work out, your body has to kick in and release adrenaline and endorphins that's going to make you feel awake. And so even if it happens at five or six in the evening or whether it happens at five or six in the morning, at least your body has had that release of wakeness hormones that says, oh, this is the daytime because we just got our heart rate elevated and we released all these endorphins and hormones. And so this is our actual wake time. When we're in bed, when we're resting, we see that there's a big difference in everything that's happening in our body. And so now you're starting to create this regular sleep cycle. And that's what you want to achieve. Your body always wants to be in balance. So you need to have times throughout the day where you're extremely awake, especially if you have a very inactive job, and then you have times when you're resting. But you can't always be resting because your body's not going to know the difference between you being awake and slightly awake, okay? Number two is that to get happy, we release the brain chemicals. And the brain chemical that I'm talking about is called dopamine. When you have the release of dopamine, which is triggered by exercise, especially the exercises and the workouts that we do at Fit Club with the music, with the coaches, with the crowd, it increases a sense of motivation and also purpose. You think about the motivation that you're gonna have because now you're associating yourself with the goal. I know that as we get older, we start to focus less on goals because why? We've already got the job, our jobs are good enough. We've got our family, we've got our house, we've got our car. You know, we just don't wanna not be able to pay for those things, but we don't have really ambitions to grow into things. But when you start to work out, and even if it's something as simple as I wanna lose 10 pounds, at least now you have a clear outcome of what you want to achieve, and you have motivation to work out every single day or five days a week to achieve that goal. Now you've got motivation to get it done, and you've given yourself purpose to get this done. And so every time that you work out, what are you doing? You're rewarding yourself. You're creating many accomplishments five days a week where you feel good. Your body's going to release good hormones and your brain's going to make you feel good because why? You're taking one step 
moving closer to your goal. And it's like, we just did the easiest and biggest thing that we could do to drive us towards our goal. And that's just working out. When I say last set, you give me the best set, last set. Last set. And so you don't need a prescription to release the dopamine, which is what they would probably prescribe you in order for you to get these positive brain chemicals. You don't need a prescription to help you get all woozy at night or to potentially fall asleep because you've naturally balanced out when you should be awake and when you should be sleeping. Now, the last way that I'm gonna help you to get happy is your everyday life. Because why? When you walk through the door, especially when you walk through the door at Fit Club, it says this is the best 30 minutes of your day. So whatever your problems are or whatever your situations are going through, they can wait because right now we're focusing on one purpose and that's giving you the best workout. We want you to get the best workout. And when you're working out and the coach is like, let's go Jerome, you got this, or other members are over there giving you high fives or you're looking and thinking, hmm, should I go a little bit heavier today or should I challenge myself? Maybe I should try doing a push up or a box jump. All of these things are separating you from what's creating this depression in you because you're so focused on what happened and you're not feeling anxious because you're not worried about all the external things that you can't control. You're only focused on what is happening right here, right now. And because you've got other members there and you've got the coach there and you yourself are internally, that's three types of people that in that short period of time are rooting for you. You've got three cheerleaders, you've got three massive fans, you've got three big supporters, and even if it's only for 30 minutes, five days a week, that's something that's so huge in everybody's life. And I guarantee you, if you follow these three things by just doing the one thing of working out, you're gonna get better sleep, you're gonna release more happy hormones, and you're gonna get the positive enforcement that you need. So guys, I hope this video helped you. And I hope that by you working out every single day or five days a week is helping you to increase your happiness and make sure that before you go, give the video a like, hit the subscribe button if you haven't, post in the comments if there's anything else that you'd want me to discuss about, and we'll see you on the next video.